Welcome everybody to the North American International Auto Show 2011 here in Detroit. And it's been exactly 10 years since Mini was relaunched with the introduction of the Mini One hatch. And although the proportions have stayed Mini, the family has gotten bigger and bigger. And we now have four complete different body types with even more body type variants ranging from the Mini One hatch over the Mini Clubman, the Mini Convertible to the Mini Countryman. Now you think Mini has the right model for almost anybody. Ready for another one? On this special anniversary, I'm going to reveal very shortly an exciting study for a further car, the new Mini Paceman concept. Now creative concepts need creative ideas, and creative ideas need creative heads to come up with the concepts. And we have the head of exterior design, Marcus Searing, now here with us to tell us a little more about this exciting design. Marcus, nice to have you here. Now maybe you can tell us a little more about this concept. Why did the BMW Group decide to build the Mini Coupe concept? The decision was made because the Paceman is the perfect bridge between the regular hatch and the Countryman. What is typical Mini about it? The whole car is a Mini. We have all the typical Mini icons on that car but with a completely new interpretation. What is different to the Mini Countryman? We have a flatter roof huh? and we have a coupe typical roof shape. The highest point is in front of the driver and then it's dropping extremely and also the whole greenhouse is getting smaller towards right. the end. It's tapering and with that we are creating wider shoulders. It makes it look very strong and muscular actually. Yeah it is, yes. Let's come to talk about the rear lights Marcus. Now these look very very interesting. They're turned around to like 90 degrees. What was the idea behind that? It makes the car look wider, stronger, and is also emphasizing the stronger shoulders on the belt line. All right. Now, let's talk about, in general, who do you think or who do you see driving this coupe? Young people young at heart, living in the city, having modern jobs, and they would like to express exactly this kind of lifestyle also with the help of, a, of their car. And I, I can imagine if it comes with this coloring, everybody would want to buy one of these, have one of these. Who came up with the idea? What's the idea behind it? The color green is, 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 uh, is considered as a conservative color in automotive industry. And we thought it's time to have a modern interpretation. Right. And in addition to that, we also added uh, brushed copper as a contrasting element to the chrome, cold and warm. Marcus, I can only say it looks great. Job well done. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Time. All right. Now we heard what the designer has to say about the car, but what do the people think about it? Let's tune in. The car is a nice, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. Fat with a PH, not with an F. Kind of new and different. Looking good, <laughs> that's two <laughs> words. <laughs> Young. Austin Powers. <laughs> now have you ever heard of Mini Connected before? Well, I've heard of it, but I don't know what it can do. But I have a guy sitting next to me right now who can tell us exactly what it can do. He is the head of technology at the office in Palo Alto. Please welcome Mr. Stefan Dola. Stefan, nice to, to meet you. Thank you. Now, maybe you can uh, give us a quick overview of what Mini Connected is all about. Sure, I'd like to. So um, I have here on my iPhone uh, our Mini Connected application. You can see there are different information about our cars, uh, what's the actual mileage, and um, um, how far can I go? And there's a couple of applications actually running on this phone. From the phone, you're going to control all the enter en exactly. entertainment, infotainment. Okay, let's do it. I connected right here. One thing uh, we are specifically proud of is our Pandora integration. Right. So Pandora is one of the most popular music services here in the US. Um, it's kind of an indirect radio. And I'm just starting right now the uh, Pandora application. So it's your standard Pandora application, and it actually gets connected to the car. So I just put it away. Right. And as you can see here, we already have had an additional uh, uh, menu item which says Pandora Radio. Right. And if you like to, you can create any radio station uh, based on your ideas or can have access to your radio station you have in the car. That is great. So I got my social network in the car, I got my music in the car, exactly. I got everything I need actually. As long as I hook up my iPhone, I'm good to go. Perfectly. Thank you. Stefan, thanks a lot. No problem. That was it from the North American International Auto Show 2011 here with Mini. And the Paceman leaves us with a great lookout on what we can expect in the future from Mini. And Mini Connected showing us what we can experience already today. 
With this, I leave you and say goodbye till next time. <laughs>